It's home to thousands of people, hundreds of species of wildlife, and brings in billions of dollars to the state. But coastal erosion, sea level rise, and storm surges are putting the Texas coast at risk. And the Texas General Land Office and the United States Army Corps of Engineers are fighting back with a Texas Coastal Study Plan, as explained by Texas Land Commissioner George P. Bush. The time is now for Texas and our nation to plan for and then implement solutions to protect our coastal communities. By taking a deeper look at three areas off the coast, including South Padre Island. We're looking to essentially protect the area from storm surge and, and hurricane damage. The plan includes a 12-foot tall, 20-foot wide dune berm and a 100-foot wide beach built in front of it across the island. All of that would be uh, made possible by taking sand from offshore sources and placing Placing it here on the island. The study will come up with solutions to be recommended to Congress with protecting lives, reducing damage, and increasing resiliency to storm surges being the focus. This study represents a large investment that the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers and the Texas General Land Office are willing to make here to assist the South Padre Island community. So residents and wildlife can continue to enjoy their home for years to come. In South Padre Island, Marlene Rodriguez, Local 23 News.